have a good day. Oh, hello. L.A. Beast here. And the other night, while I was legally high here in the state of New Jersey, as I was spaced out, my fiancé made the best possible decision for me by putting on the movie One Hour Photo, starring Robin Williams. Now, not only was I surprised to see lovable Robin Williams playing a psycho stalker working at a one-hour photo kiosk, but for the entire movie, I could not stop staring at his bleach blonde head. And for the duration of the movie, I could not stop thinking about other celebrities over the years who have bleached their entire head, such as Justin Timberlake, Brad Pitt, Eminem, Patrick Swayze from the movie Point Break, and Guy Fieri. And then I wondered what I would look like if I bleached my entire head and face. So here we are. And within the next 15 minutes, it is most likely going to look like I have a farmer's tan from the neck up. What? Because I went on Amazon and for $33.99, I purchased the Manic Panic Amplified Bleach Hair Kit to where because I have no public obligations until January, I am going to bleach my entire head safely and 87% and responsibly. So without further ado, let's get started. Pretty sure, okay, I'm pretty sure I have no obligations until January. Uh, so let's get started. I have my gloves. I have a second pair of gloves. Um, I've never actually bleached my hair before. My friend Chris, um, back in ninth grade, actually got frosted tips uh, as he wore his Abercrombie and Fitch necklace there. No, but I was never one of those people until now. I have semi-read the instructions to this Amplified Flash Lightning kit. Uh, I am willing to sacrifice my sweet Pepsi, Ray Charles, you got the right one, baby, uh-huh, t-shirt, but I'm not willing to sacrifice my Expos hat. So I'm going to safely put that there. Uh, this is what it looked like with no hat on. Uh, so without further ado, you, you're you not supposed to inhale the powder. Just shut up and do it. Okay, we're getting powder all over the table. All right, boom. <laughs> The powder, the powder is getting all over the place. Uh, okay, we hit record. Oh. Okay, great. We got the cream developer going into the glass. Uh, as you can see right there, boom. Mixing it around, mixing it around. We can speed this part up here. Okay, um, it really does actually smell like bleach. Uh, I'm actually going to, you gotta start from the end uh, and work your way in towards the scalp and then uh, place the shower cap on your head. And that's when we'll get started on my beard and mustache. Uh, so I've never actually done this before, but we're going to do it starting now. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. I just want to make sure to not get this in my eyes. Okay, is there a time limit? I don't know if there's a time limit to get all this onto your head. No idea what I'm doing. Oh, <laughs> uh, and again, I'm using the Amplified Jesus, the Amplified kit. Um, let's get some sides. And this is not to over apply. I can't even see what I'm doing. Okay, great. I think you know what? Cool. And I think from here, my hair is my hair is falling out. Right, shower cap it up. Uh, and then I believe I have to check uh, every 10 minutes or so. Uh, to see how we're doing. So check intervals during the process. It'll be 10 minutes to do so. Okay, hair is not reached as I reapply re mixture. Continue process. Do not over bleach. Got to get this second glove on, and we're going to move on to my beard and eyebrows. And so far, uh, I'm not feeling any burning sensations yet on my head. Okay, okay idiot. Great. Oh, I have no idea what I'm doing. Preconditioner. Why do we have preconditioner? Mix activator and bleach cream into the mixing cup using the act. Mix, Jesus, mix the activator. I'm just putting on some pre applicate. Got it all over my favorite blanket. Can you put this on your mouth? Be I'm now gonna be very careful for my eyebrows here. Start with the eyebrows. Is 
This is this is idiotic. All right, so we got. We, I look like I look like Albert Einstein. Good, great, we got that there. Gonna look like Hollywood Hogan, Albert Einstein. Even though I'm doing this, have I reached a new low? No, I haven't. Uh, I am the LA Beast. Uh, I have eight minutes to go on my face. Slight tingle feeling. Uh, and then I guess uh, I have another minute before I have to check my head. <laughs> Without further ado, I am the LA Beast and hopefully when I take this towel away from my head, I look like Robin Williams from the movie. One hour photo. This is gonna be ridiculous. I, I have not looked in the mirror yet. So here we go. <sighs> Holy shit, it looks like I have no eyebrows. Okay, well, great. Uh, right off the bat, it looks like I have no eyebrows. Uh, uh, Jesus. Fair, you know what? I would say from the 1939 movie, The Wizard of Oz with the Technicolor, I think there was like, uh, I look like one of the people from the Lollipop Guild. They had like uh, this reddish, blondish hair. Uh, and or quite possibly I look like the caddy from Happy Gilmore. Okay, uh, you know what, the, the beard, uh, the beard kind of looks a little bit puby, uh, like Jake Paul's beard. Uh, but besides that, not bad, not bad, uh, I, I think. If I had my eyebrows, it wouldn't look as bad as it does now. So, cool. I guess I have to get the the before and after shot, and then, uh, Jesus, I look like, the, if anybody's ever seen the movie Powder, uh, there's a guy who had, like, special magnetic abilities, uh, but yes, he was as white uh, as Uncle Fester in the movie The Addams Family. There's a lot of things I look like. Uh, let me know what I look like in the comments section down below, but nonetheless, you know what? I think I can rock this. Oh, boy. Well, you know what? The one thing I could definitely say for sure is that the Amplified uh, works. This, this is the LA Beast. Have a good day! Jesus, this is awesome. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh, my God. You scared me. Jesus. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, my oh. God. <laughs> okay, Zach Morris.